<laughs> when you have there's a lot of people out there who don't share details with their doctor because they're embarrassed because it's another human they're talking to. You think if you're talking if, to if some sort of bot? A, if we had a bot, they'd be more forthcoming. Yes. I yes. think so. I think yes. so. <laughs> yes. I think so too. Because going back to the empathy, like it's a robot, so they and so like think about like social media. People are more willing to share their, their, you know, how they really feel subconsciously on there. I think they would do the same thing with an AI robot, uh, doctor. Ooh. I think so, too. And I think or, they'd be curious about what the bot would say based on what they tell it. So they may be a little bit more forthcoming. Than... You have got to re uh... <laughs> <laughs> It is very treatable. <laughs> Don't worry. We will get rid of this in seven to ten days. Your prescription can be picked up at a local CVS. It's 98% sure. <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah, I, I think I don't know. I think there's some now. I think there's some now. I'd give it a shot for again a routine checkup or a straightforward see. diagnosis. Yeah. Like like a physical, yeah, I do physical with AI. Yeah. Physical. But I feel like it would have to be. I, w- I would want it to be where they could you could do like a, a visual scan and they could scan your body and temperature, you know, do ultrasound, do X rays, yes. all in the scan, something yeah. like that. Would yeah. be awesome. Would be awesome. It's, it's like you step into like that TSA machine. <laughs> you your hands up. You have gonorrhea. So. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I knew that. It's just it has to let us know. What <laughs> it's it's going to say everything that you have. It just has to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Cavities. <laughs> yeah. Yo, you also are very at risk for Russian sudden death. Uh, <laughs> Russian <laughs> sudden death. <laughs> what? Right, any windows if you can. <laughs> Stay away from windows. Don't drink any tea. Uh, pay all your debts off to anybody. You know. mm-hmm. Jesus, man. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> it would be. It'd be fun to hear about as well. Um, Maybe. Oh, before we go, segue. Um, oh, your story, right? Well, I wanted to see that anybody... I know I think Tandy, but I want to hear Tandy's opinion too. Did anybody see the new MLK statue? Yeah, I, I didn't it. until you shared it. Love okay. It. Gotta pull it up. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I can pull it up. Okay. Yeah, because man, <clears throat> the comments, man, was hilarious. But I'm not gonna lie, there was one comment that said that all they could think about was the verse uh eat the booty like groceries. Oh, <laughs> and, and when I and when I looked at it through that lens, man, I I died. Like it's gross. Yeah, it's just <laughs> yeah. That's this is the CNN article. Um, I don't think they really have like a it's, full it's, a, of it. There's a yeah. Get some um. There's some images. There's this really great image of it with with a person like, looking at it, and their head is like cocked to the uh, side. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, yeah you, feel free to share. Of that, I'm trying to find it. it's in Boston. Is that where it is? Yeah. No wonder it. it... That would I... <laughs> yeah, it would be. I was like, this. You know what? This is way too abstract for a concrete individual. A concrete individual that we don't. You know, we've got some images, but if we're gonna put them around the the country, we can have con concrete representations or something that's you know I, mm-hmm. I, I mean maybe no, as a painting, right yeah. maybe in a museum maybe as a painting but like yeah. public art a public you know people are gonna yeah. <laughs> I got one hold on let me know. share this one hey, I'm not, I, this I one does know. this one does look like somebody's holding a leg on a body head and they just giving them yeah, a lot of just, what they call it, kind of like yeah. fellatio or whatever. I'm, I'm gonna share. So you think it looks like fellatio? I saw other comments that said it looks like, uh, like a phallic sh- symbol. 
I don't really see either mm -hmm. one. Like I don't, I don't see that one, but I, I'll show you this one that that looks like. Do you want to share? Yeah, I'll share, or or I'll send you the link. I'll send you the link. Yeah, and I couldn't really understand it until I saw the the photo the was based picture? on. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Photo. It's like, well, Me too. if you need a piece of art to sort of explain your piece of art, then. <laughs> What what have you done? Okay, you know, yeah, yeah you see it now. You made, yeah. <laughs> you made some really nice bronze work. <laughs> sure, yeah, yeah, that that yeah, that's a piece. Sorry, I don't I don't subscribe to the New York Times, so it's giving me a paywall. Um, oh, oh, I need to make an account or something, so you might it? need to share it. Okay, I was gonna say because it let me collapse this. Wait, maybe I can. Should okay, just... I got, I got it, I got it. Wait, okay. I was able to grab it. <laughs> yeah. Don't that look like a thigh? It's just like and somebody yeah. just giving them straight. This okay. <laughs> you say that. <laughs> I can, I can, I can see that's how you eat, might see the, that. <laughs> that's the eat the boy like grocery statue. From, I can oh. never, I can never unsee it. Now I see this. it. Yeah, I feel like with a sculpture like this, you kind of need to like look at it at every angle just to make sure it's looking how you expect it to look. There shouldn't be a bad angle for no. a sculpture of this no. size in this location. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's too abstract. I don't think anything about MLK was abstract. So to me, I think it was a little off. <clears throat> um, yeah. Had it been like a... Uh, Who's in, who's in that? Yeah, let's say like a guy like Prince, for example. There was things about Prince that was very like right. intriguing and, and enigmatic. I can see a statue that's like kind of questionable. Prince, okay. But MLK, yeah, that, that, that looks... It just it, it didn't give me a good feeling when I first saw right. it. I'll be honest, it didn't give me a good feeling. You know, all jokes aside, it's like, mm. yeah, not as I don't really like seeing like disembodied hands and arms. That's, yeah, I, I don't, it's, it's a bit unnerving for me. We're missing something, <laughs> yeah, it's 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 really it's really missing something, you know. Yeah. I see beautiful sculpture work, but it's, I, I don't know, I'm just thinking. <laughs> <laughs> All bodo, bodo on top of each other. It's just maybe, yeah. maybe you need to be there. You know, maybe you need to go yeah. see it for yourself in person. Yeah, and that'll true. change your the whole pro The problem is, it. it's in Boston. Yeah. <laughs> it makes me more likely to not go see it more than it looks. One more time. <laughs> just, to, just to see the suspect. Is yes. it better or worse than the bean? Oh, the, the bean in Chicago? Sure, yeah. Yeah, there's the bean one, is a bean. That's cool. There's one, <laughs> That's in, Houston. The bean. There's one in Houston, too. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's I mean, like sideways or something. Sideways, quote unquote. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I, <laughs> like it has a we, way. <laughs> we have a. I think we, you know, I, I'll speak for myself. You know, it's more of an emotional attachment to Martin Luther King than to a bean. Yeah. So you know, I, that is like, eh. but it's like, come on, man. It's you know, fought for the holiday. You know, his birthday. He, he, you know, endured all these things. He died a tragic death. There's so much emotion connected to that. And then to see that, it's like, what? I mean, I don't think we've transcended. We, we, Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> we, we, we cut to a, um, another, we cut to another hospital, the same hospital as earlier. <laughs> Hello, er, um, nurse, uh, doc, oh. doctor, sorry. Um, yeah, whoever's in, in the hallway, uh, I can see you You guys all out there. Um, yeah, uh, you guys moving to the MLK suite? Oh. I'm expecting something much more different than this. This is just, I mean, it's hardly a room. Yeah, uh, yeah, we get a lot of questions about it. Um, uh -huh. right, initially we thought it would let's do something different, let's transcend the usual. Um, but you're right, um, it is different. 
Uh, yeah, it's, it's if you don't mind me saying, uh, hi, I was in the committee uh, along with mm-hmm. the artist. It's based on one of his shoes. Mm. Uh, he he had some very nice shoes, and this room yeah. is based on one of them, the left one, in case you you didn't realize. Yeah, there's I, another, I figured by the shape. Yeah, in in the yeah. other wing, there's the right shoe, which is a lot of fun. Yeah. So, so I'm in know, the left shoe. You're in the left shoe. Oh, okay. But on the, in the right wing of the hospital, the right shoe. Okay, because you know I, I fell out of the window in the, the the Russian suite and broke my leg, and yeah. you know then I heard I was coming to the you know the MLK suite. I thought, oh great, wonderful. I can recuperate in, you know, a nice, comfortable, uplifting room. But I'm just in a shoe. I'm just in a giant shoe. But it's but it's MLK shoe. It's, it's MLK shoe. I mean, uh-huh. a lot of work went into the detail. I mean, we, we've got a couple of blankets. I, I hope you're warm enough. Got a couple of blankets there in the, in the, in the toe box area. So, you know, you can scoot up there and, and sleep later. But look, look, look at the, look at the, the, um, um, Look at the the holes the, the, where you where the laces go. I mean this. Yeah, but yeah, there's, that, there's no be... yeah, there's holes where the laces go. There's no laces. There's no laces. There's no laces. Oh, no. laces. It makes it even more kind of weird, you know. Well, weird. people said that some days MLK did not wear laces. The theory. <laughs> little known fact. Little known. Little or known theory. Fact. I mean, you know, it's it's something to think about. We didn't want we wanted to challenge your mental as you're recuperating. Who wants to just rest? Wouldn't you like to look around this shoe and just wonder first why we chose it? Mm-hmm. And, and second, you know, all of the places that um, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. marched in a shoe. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. And at 8 a.m. every morning, we play Martin Luther King's speech. But it sounds like you're in the shoe while he's saying it. So you, it sounds like a distant speech. <laughs> kind of like if you lived in his shoe when he said it. That's, so I get like the experience of his foot. Um. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Fine. You haven't even been here long, and you got it. Amazing. That's yes. amazing. That's amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and close the window in here. This is really great. But thank you. Yeah, it's a <laughs> yeah. Chilly, chilly out there. Um, yeah. I'm. I'm just gonna be honest. I, I'm not really enjoying this. I'm gonna go ahead and open much. the window again <laughs> and. <laughs> <laughs> and that is the can't tell us nothing to show everybody. Thanks so much for hanging out. Welcome to the year 2023. We'll be back. Let me look at the calendar here. The first Tuesday of February, which is the seventh. Mm-hmm. All right, let's do the thing. But until then, have oh, a great January. Also, we got bad flicks and chill this Ooh, Sunday, yep. January 22nd, 7 p.m. Showing one of my favorite bad movies. Exactly. Oh. Everybody, what did I say?